Hi, this is Ambarish here. What we will do today is that we will go into Spark SQL and we would do with a case study. The case study is with a used car data set which is a vehicles listings from Craigslist.org. Craigslist is the world's largest collection of used vehicles for sale and this data data set has been compiled in Kaggle by Austin Rees who is a Kaggle expert and you can find the data set here. What I have done is that I have downloaded it into my machine and it is mounted here and now what we will do is that we will create a spark session, we will get the path and now what we are doing is that defining the schema for the data. The schema for the data has several parts. First is that it has a name, it has a data type and whether it has any constraints. Then we are loading it with the format which is a CSV format. The separator is a comma, the schema is a mention schema and the header is true. We find the length of the columns by df.columns we can see the first three rows by df.show. We can select a column known as cylinders and show it. We'll skip this part because we will go in depth in PySpark a little bit later. We'll clean the data. We are eliminating the prices which are less than zero. We are having a summary of the price by df.describe price dot show and what we get is the count, mean, standard deviation, min and the max. We create a temporary view known as the used cards. We count the number of cards where there is an invalid year by doing a select count one from used cards where year is less than zero. We do a spark.sql, SQL query and we show the 25 rows here. Fortunately, there are no ones with a zero year, uh, which is an invalid year. We count the cards where the wins appear more than one. Here we are doing select win, count one as count win from used cards, group by win having count greater than one count of cards having same URL more than one similar logic URL count one as count URL from used cards group by URL having count URL greater than one. We want to find the cards number of cards by region select region count one as count region from used cards group by region order by count region desk. So the ones which the regions with the highest cards appear at the first. So you are understanding that Spark SQL has made it very easy for a SQL developer to work in Spark. Cards by model, similar logic, select model, count one from used cards, group by model, order by count one desk and we can see those things. Calculate the average price standard deviation for each condition, similar logic, select condition, count one average price as average, standard deviation, STD dev price as standard dev, mean price as mean, max price as max, from used cards group by condition, order by count one desk. So the highest condition cards appear the first. So we are seeing that some do not have any condition, so it is null and the others we are getting all these things. Count par group model manufacturer year. We are doing a select model year count one and we are grouping by model manufacturer and year and we are getting this the power of SQL is at we are getting to see more. This is another interesting 
manifestation of the power of SQL and we are using with rollup. We are using select a model manufacturer year count one from used cards where model is Cambry. I have reduced the data set by filtering it where model is Cambry and a group by a model manufacturer year with a rollup order by count one desk. What is rollup? It is grouping by several factors. It is grouping by model manufacturer year, model manufacturer, model, and no grouping. So no grouping is, is nothing is grouped. So it is like as it select model manufacturer year count one from used cards where model is equal to Camry and group by model with roll up ordered by count one desk. So it is something like that. So we can see it. You see it is 2827 and we get 2827 here. Similarly, we would get when when we are grouping by model and manufacturer, you are getting Toyota is 2825 and 2 and so here we are doing a model and manufacturer. You can see it also here coming Camry is 2825 and the Nissan is 2. So instead of doing multiple groupings, you can do it by in this manner. This is especially good if you are doing a report. Similarly, you are doing this one, which is um, which is manufacturer and year and we get this grouping select model manufacturer year and you get this so all the years are coming into picture another fantastic sequel is count per group model manufacturer and year with cube so it goes further it is more grouping and all combinations here what it does in one shot it is grouping by model manufacturer year model manufacturer manufacturer year model year model manufacturer year and blank so these are the ones that you can see down here with cube order by count one desk so this is the one that you can see there is a distinct model which is a select count of distinct model from used cards so this is the model which is a distinct models are shown and then there is an another one which is the approximate count distinct which is similar to distinct but it gives an approximate it is gives it is faster than count distinct do we have a difference yes there is a slight difference then we can use a ranking and the ranking what we are doing we are doing a ranking by price so the highest rank price come up the most so we are doing a select model manufacturer year price dense rank over order by price descending price rank from used cards so this is a dense rank and what is the ordering it is in descending price so the highest prices are coming up the most and it is coming up later so that is the number one rank is one and the number two rank is second and the number three rank is third so this is what is the thing second is the we are partitioning by the manufacturer it should be manufacturer here so what we are doing is that so this is ordering by price and we are partitioning by manufacturer what it means that we are making the manufacturer as one block and we are ordering here unfortunately there is a lot of nulls here and that's why we are seeing all these things that is coming out here but if we make a little bit more change you see the power of sql is as i keep on repeating it is available to the SQL developer. Here, what we are doing is that we are partitioning by manufacturer, but we are taking only the first three ranks. 
you see here select star from the same query we are partitioning by the manufacturer where price rank is less than 4. So you see here the nulls is one partition and you have the rank till 3 and then you have the buick which is uh, rank till 3 and then you have the jaguar which uh, rank till 3 and then there is the land rover the lexus and the mitsubishi so this completes our lecture on spark sequel and thank you for being with us hope you liked it bye